What's up, everyone? It's Tuesday. And we are down at the Woodmere Docks. It's been a while since we've been down here. Really cool sunrise this morning. What is like glass? is the ride at dawn view oh benny's on benny look what we got today oh yeah look at that mr elite be elite every day ride at dawn what else is getting on we need more than benny on here what else is getting on here who else is getting on here you up to Benny. Sweaty hat, yeah. All right, we'll let this plane flash. Oh, hi, there's Eva. Good morning, Eva. Joe, what's up? All right, we'll let this plane pass us. Noise up here. Kevin Brady's on. All right, we can start. Oh, Tyler's on. All right, all right. Tuesday morning. This is uh, my first ride back in uh, the area because uh, we were riding upstate the last two days. And uh, yeah, it's Taylor. Did you out on that bike yet, Taylor? So Taylor went out and bought a bike because of my ride at dawn. It's freaking awesome. So uh, yeah, we're rocking the Elite hat today. Uh, still waiting for my Elite boxer shorts to come in. Uh, Benny, I don't know what we gotta do for that. So we are, uh, we were out here down by the water. Got an awesome sunrise today, kind of a cool glow. And, uh, so we are back, back in the neighborhood. Sport me for my couch, that doesn't work. Let's go, get out and ride. <laughs> All right, so. Message for the day, message for the day. So this morning I flipped on uh, my podcast and of course Ryan Stuman was up, the Rewire podcast, and uh, he made a pretty good point, something that I'm guilty of myself. Um, what are you working for? What are you working for in life? Uh, are you setting goals and you're completing your goals? Um, if, you, if your goal is just to make as much money as possible, you'll never be satisfied. But if your goal is to make enough money to buy a Lambo, then you make that money and you buy a Lambo and you celebrate that win. Um, if you make a goal, I find it myself, if I make a goal to ride 10 miles, once I hit that 10 mile point, um, kind of satisfying and uh, kind of lets me relax and appreciate it. Um, <laughs> yeah, no pictures in the boxes, Kev? Listen, my, uh, my ride at Dawn Body's getting there, you know? So, uh, I'm get another plane. Um, he talked about, uh, he talked about date night. If your goal is to have an epic date night, when you have that date night, enjoy it. Put your phone down. Don't sit on your phone trying to make more money. Um, and it's, I find it really true. Um, a lot of times, uh, especially in my life, my goal was to make as much money as possible at any, any cost. And, uh, that cost sometimes is, uh, quality time with the family. Um, you miss out on a lot of stuff because we're, we're constantly looking for that next deal. We're constantly looking for that next uh, social media post that's going to get attention. Um, and I've kind of learned myself, just put the phone down. Enjoy, enjoy the moment. Um, set that goal. I said if your goal is to, uh, you know, have a certain amount of investment, set a goal on that, work to it, and complete that goal before you move to the next one. Because uh, if you don't have the goals and you don't meet your goals, you're never going to be satisfied in life. Um, and it's, it's super true, you know, um, I set a goal to ride 365 days in a row and, uh, we are on, uh, what are we on 60, no, 50 days today, 50 days today in a row. Um, every day when I check off another day, it's satisfying. It's a win. Um, when we get to 365, that's going to be a, obviously a major accomplishment. Um, don't know if I'm going to keep riding, but I know once I get to 365, I'll be able to, uh, celebrate a little bit um 
So, pretty good thought of the day. Uh, if you have any comments on that, jump in there. But um, set goals, set attainable goals, and uh, reach those goals, and um, get the momentum going in your life. Um, I don't know if any of you guys watch Dave Ramsey. Dave Ramsey has this thing called the debt snowball. And uh, what he does is he, you pay off your debts from the smallest to the largest. And uh, usually everyone thinks that's the opposite. But the reason you do that is because you need to win. Because if you don't win, you don't want to keep going. So if you pay off your $500 credit card first, you won that. Then you pay off your $2,500 credit card. Then you won that. It makes you want to keep winning. It makes you want to keep going to the point where your goal is where you're debt-free. Um, and if you didn't have those wins, you didn't want to keep going. So, um, you know, if you're going to ride your bike, set a goal to ride two miles. Then set a goal to ride five miles. Then sort of set a goal to ride ten miles. And just keep setting those goals and, see, and keep hitting those goals. Because if you don't hit the goals, you're never satisfied and you give up. And, um, yeah, so that's the message of the day. Set your goals, meet your goals, and win every day in life. So... All right, that said, we have Father Eugene back. Yeah. <laughs> and we got Janine. So, uh, Father Eugene, yeah. what do you think of that message today? How about we got to win, right? We got to meet our goals. We got to set goals and meet them because otherwise we just keep going and going and going. We're never satisfied. Yeah. So if we don't have anything to, to aim for and don't have any purpose to the reason we're working, um, you know, there's, there's basically no no goal if there's no goal you're just aimlessly wandering aimlessly working and uh you don't you're never satisfied and you don't want to keep going yeah yeah thank you so much brian for the beautiful message and then i would want to also support that uh, message and then tell everyone there you have to make every effort to keep your goal and then walk towards it um, as much as possible, not many things at a time, one thing at a time, mm. one day at a time. Uh, you win. Once you achieve one, you get over it and begin another one. At times we spend, uh, spend a lot of energy doing so many things at a time and then you are not achieving anything. So. Keep your goal straight, make it simple, have it um, on hand, and then do something. So we ask God today to always uh, support us and uh, guide us as we also make our choices and uh, pick our goals, and that uh, we may always come out uh, winners and uh, successful. So we pray God to bless everyone today. Uh, Brian, happy birthday. Oh, yeah. I yeah, know. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we, we are in there two days ago, but we prayed for you, and then I know it all went well, and we ask God to continually bless you with good health of mind and body, and uh, bless all your endeavors. Many, many happy returns. Oh, thank you, Father. Okay, so we pray now. Get the helmet off. <laughs> yeah. That makes a good point um, with setting goals, you know, um, we tend to overwhelm ourselves. We're, we're trying to multitask too much stuff. And, um, you know, if we set 20 goals, we're never going to reach any of them. So, you know, set one goal, maybe two goals, and knock off those goals one at a time. Because uh, if you overwhelm yourself, again, the whole, whole problem we all get is that, um, you know, we get overwhelmed and we give up because it just becomes too much. You know, if there's no finish line, you just keep running. You don't know where the finish line is. So you're going to give up. So when you set these attainable goals and you hit them one at a time, and you win one at a time, it makes you want to keep winning, it makes you want to keep going. So, that was a nice ad there, Father. Okay. Appreciate that. Yeah. We pray in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our hope is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, that we be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Almighty God, we thank you for the gift of life, the gift of a new day. We thank you for this opportunity to also continue our project. The, we ride at dawn. We thank you for the gift of uh, Brian as he continues to also lead us. Thank you for his friendship. Oh, thank you for Janine. Thank you for her family and then also her projects and their work. We ask you to continue and bless everyone out there today. Your protection. We ask for your blessings. Ask for also your guidance. And we pray that you continually take care of all those in special needs, the sick, those in the hospital, those at home. Today we also pray for everyone who is there at work, people on their different uh, activities and programs. We have the pilots, those also on air now, those uh, at the bottom of the sea, the sailors and every other one, transporters ask you to bless them, protect them, and then grant them also the joy of uh, uh, accomplished work. And we ask you, most importantly, as we carry on with our day, that we will always keep in mind and have you also in our programs and projects. And we will all be happy as you live and reign forever and ever. The Lord be with you. And may the Almighty God bless you, Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Amen. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Janine, for Janine, the inspiration. Janine. <laughs> Janine. We're here by the airport, and we're watching the planes come in every three minutes. And yeah. I was telling Father Eugene, it's amazing to me that right now as we stand here, there's thousands of people in the air and thousands of people under the ocean. So. It is, yeah, it is so pretty crazy. We one. forget yeah. them always. But we pray yeah, for them yeah. because uh, almost everyone now and then we make a, a trip and then yeah, yeah, people yeah. are walking. And uh, it definitely is uh, yeah. amazing every time you get an airplane and you just trust that uh, <laughs> this big piece of metal is going to fly through the air. Oh, my God. And, uh, you know, we're putting our faith in a pilot that we've never met before. Yeah. I always thought that was pretty wild. I mean, yeah, so we need know. to pray for them. And then we did already today and we continue to rem yeah. remember them. Yeah. yeah. Blind faith, right? They Blind talk about faith. that, right? Yeah. Yeah. You know, everyone talks about, uh, you know, have faith in God and you can't see him. But meanwhile, you have faith in a pilot that you can't see. Yeah. You know, you get in a plane, he's locked in the front and he puts, you know, takes your life in, in his hands. And, yeah. you know, we trust a pilot we don't know, but a lot of people won't trust God that they don't know. <laughs> um, kind of a neat parallel there. Um, blind faith. Yeah. Um, yeah. So, uh, anyway, so, uh, all right. So, message. You got the message of the day. Set goals, reach your goals, knock them out one by one. Uh, you got to keep winning in life because uh, that makes you want to keep going. You can't just say, I want to make a ton of money because you just keep working, 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 you're never satisfied. Um, you can't say, I want to run a million miles because you'll keep running, 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 you're never satisfied. So set goals, hit those goals, and uh, win every day. It makes you want to keep winning. So And come right at dawn, uh, 6 a.m. every morning, corner of Scarcliff Drive and Cornwell Avenue, in Malvern and we're live here about 640 it's been hitting and uh, with our message of the day so we are 50 days into this journey of 365 and uh, we're on a roll we're on a roll beautiful morning we're down here Woodmere Docks if you've never been down here throw it in Google or in Maps Ways Woodmere Docks beautiful place to come down reflect reflect Peace, pray. The sun's beautiful. All right, everyone. Happy Tuesday. God bless. Shout out to Elite. Shout out to Mikey Mattress. Uh, some people in my life that are, take care of me. So return the favor. All right, everyone. God bless. We'll see you soon. Tomorrow morning, right at 6 a.m., live at 640. Be good.